digital TV. Download iPlayer. And online. The new sound of Asian Britain. Racist election. This is Asian Network. BBC.co.uk slash Asian Network. Now, she's one of Bollywood's favourite actresses who starred in hits like Kiamat Se Kiamat Tak and Dar. Yep, we're talking about the gorgeous and beautiful, delightful Juhi Chavla, who joins us now. Juhi, welcome to Love Bollywood. Thank you so much. So you're here promoting Bhutna. Tell us about that. Yeah, it's, uh, well, it's releasing on the 9th of May and I'm really looking forward to it because I think... Um, uh, you remember my film, Hame Rai Ke? Yeah, it was fantastic. Well, <laughs> yeah. Yes, a lot of kids enjoyed yes. it, a lot of families enjoyed it. And when I met, uh, whenever I meet people, they always said, you know, how come you don't make more films like that? And I was like, you know, scripts like that don't come easy. Uh-huh. Um, well, Bhutnath has, is not the same kind of film, but it's got the same kind of appeal, I think. Uh, it reaches out to kids. It's uh, it's a fun film. It's clean. It's you know kids can watch it. Mummies can watch it. Grandmummies can watch it, and have a great time. It's it's fun. It's naughty. It's nice. It's good, and it's also emotional. So it's a nice package, and uh, I'm in it. What else? Yes. What do you ask for? <laughs> You're quite selective when it comes to um, picking what films you want to do. Um, what is it about a film that makes you think? Yes, I want to do this one. Mostly it's the script. I mean, uh, you know, I've come from times, uh, I've worked in films where I knew nothing about what was going to be filmed. I just Uh knew who is the actor, who is the producer and the director. And that's it. And that's it. And now since the past couple of years, Uh we have, you know, bound scripts coming to us and, um, you know, you can hear it out, you know, who's directing you. Um, So it's, it's mostly that. It's when... I hear a script, I may not have the best role in the film, mm, mm. but if it sounds to me like a wholesome, nice uh, thing, uh-huh. then I kind of say yes and I will be a part of it. <laughs> you know, with reference to Bhutnath, um, yes. initially, if I uh, remember correctly, um, with Ravi Chopra and B.R. Chopra films, you were offered the role of Drupati. Yes. <laughs> uh, way back. And you chose, yeah, way back, yes. And now you're back in the B.R. Chopra. How's, what, what's the transition like? Well, at that point, at that time, I had just stepped into the industry and uh, I really didn't know where I was headed. I'm not sure exactly how I came to know Chopra Saab. I think somewhere my family must have known okay. him or something. I, I went to meet him. Uh, he said, OK, we are making this Mahabharat. Uh, maybe we can video test you as okay. for one of the characters. And then I was shortlisted for Draupadi. And for me, it was a big thing because it was like, wow. Uh-huh. But at the same time, I... Luckily, fortunately for me, I got selected to do Kayamat Se Kayamat Tak as well. And uh, Nazar Saab said, you can't do both, you have to take a pick. <laughs> and uh, I was told, I think it would be better, you know, you get a chance exactly. to do a film, exactly. is, um, he must. So I, I, you know, I came to do that and had to say, um, give my apologies to Chopra Saab. Oh. Uh, well... I remained in touch with the, the Chopras over the years. I always went to visit them, pay my respects. 